What's good YouTube? It's your boy D Money here back with another banger video, man. And today, as you guys can see by the title, man, be willing to fail to win. They gonna hate anyways. You feel me? Before we start this video, guys, make sure you like comment subscribe a lot of you guys watching the vids but are subscribed go ahead and hit that subscribe button and it helps support the channel also guys i really do appreciate 10k subscribers man we're on the road to 15k we grind on every single day and we ain't stopping you dig comment down below what you guys want to see next and i got you man y'all been showing me so much love and i really do appreciate that now before we start this video guys like i always state take everything that i say with a grain of salt you feel me my perspective might change a day Two days, a year from now, who knows, we're constantly growing. And if you're not growing, what are you doing? Also, guys, I love hearing the stories, the messages. You guys are such a big inspiration to me, man. Honestly, when I read the comments, I get inspired, I get motivated, and I'm hoping you guys do the same thing. I hope you guys get inspired and motivated by me, too, with the words that I'm bringing to you guys. You feel me? And if you guys, uh, you know what I'm saying, have some more personal to tell me, let me know on Instagram. I do respond. I might be a couple days late, but I do respond. You feel me? And if you guys do not agree with what I'm saying, please, please let me know in the comment section. I'm understanding, I'm understanding. I got an open mind. This is an open-minded channel. Now check me out, y'all. Let me know right now if y'all like this quality, if y'all rocking with the quality. My dog chewed up my camera, he messed it up. My phone all messed up, I can't even really use it like that. But it's all good, you feel me? So let me know if y'all like the quality of this. I got my camera, and we might start filming off of this, you feel me? Now let's get right into the video though. Now listen y'all, in the world right now that we live in, so many, people are, so many people are afraid to go after what it is that they want in life. So many people are afraid to go chase their dreams. Not chase it, because I hate using the word chase, guys. Because when you chase it, you're never gonna reach it. You feel me? You always gonna be trying to go for something, that's, you know what I'm saying? It's never gonna be what you want. You feel what I'm saying? So when I tell you guys, you guys have dreams, you guys have you know aspirations, you guys have something that you want out of life, right? You have to go get it. Failure is inevitable, it's gonna happen. People are gonna hate on you on the way to your dreams and your goals and your aspirations. It's gonna be a lot of people, friends, family, mom, dad, sister, cousin, best friend, people that's closest to you that's not gonna see your vision. It's gonna be a lot of people that's not gonna, they're not gonna accept what it is that you wanna do out of life. It's not gonna be, it's gonna be a lot of people that's gonna tell you that you can't make videos and, and, and inspire people. It's gonna tell, it's gonna be a lot of people that's gonna tell you, hey bro, you know, they're gonna make jokes about what it is that you got going on, bro. You make videos, you talking about spirituality or whatever, they're gonna make jokes about it. If you, if you making videos, just entertainment purposes, talking about going outside and you just vlogging, whatever, you going to the gym, they're gonna make fun of it. People are going to hate on what it is that you got going on because they don't understand it. They don't see the vision. They don't see the motivation, the process that you have, the everything that's moving in your brain. They don't see that. A lot of people are afraid to get to where you are. A lot of people are afraid to think for themselves. And guys, when you start your dream, when you chase, when you, when you working for your dream, when you manifest it, just know that failure is a lesson learned. You guys gotta realize that a failure is a lesson learned. Don't ever, don't ever get to the point in life where you are afraid to fail because it's going to happen. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna. Once you fail, it, it, it you, you get, you get lessons. You get lessons for you to move on to the next stage. It's like a game. Life is like a game. You feel me? It's like a video game. And we constantly, we constantly moving on to the next. You know what I'm saying? Level. And every time you make sure my dog ain't eating, you, hey, he, you gotta watch my dog, you know what I'm saying? My dog always chewing up stuff, he chewing up the phone, he chewing up, you know what I'm saying? I barely can click on it, you feel me? But every time you move into the next stage, y'all, every time you move into the next stage, every time you fail at something, if you got a business and you working on a business, you an entrepreneur, you working on artwork or you working on music and the music don't sell or don't go crazy like you want it to, or you making YouTube videos and you're not getting the views like that, you failing as you so, you know what I'm saying, as you think, you're failing. But every single time you make a video, you getting that lesson like, okay, this is what time I need to post this video because uh, last time it did, it did a lot it did a lot more views at this point in time at 12 o'clock instead of what you call it. So my audience is watching this. So last time my video failed, but let me go ahead and post this video at this time. 
Or let me go outside and you know what I'm saying, this neighborhood, they don't really, you know what I'm saying, like the, the stuff that I bring, the, the, the business that I bring to them. So let me go try out this other neighborhood. You feel me? I failed yesterday, but I, today I'm gonna try something different. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna continue to go back to the same thing, right? We don't have insanity around here. We're not, we're not, you, hey, insanity is doing something over and over and over again, expecting a different result. And we don't do that. You feel me? We let that, we let that failure teach us a lesson of what to do and what not to do. You feel me? Because we take bits and pieces. I tell you guys in my videos all the time, take everything with a grain of salt, right? Because we constantly learning every single day. You guys gotta think of that. That mindset, you gotta have that mindset when it's coming to your dreams and your goals. You gotta have that mindset. You gotta take something with a grain of salt every single day, take bits and pieces. Every time you meet somebody new, they might have something to, to tell you. And, and sometimes people have something good to tell you, you know what I'm saying? And then sometimes it's a lot of negative energy, a lot of negative talk, it's a lot of, but from out of that conversation, you gotta look at the good. You feel me? I always talk about the glass half full, not the glass half empty. I don't think of it, I don't think of it negative. You feel me? I just take what's positive out of that conversation. You might have said a hundred things, you, you might have said 99 things that I would never use. But that one thing might have stood out and I'm just like, okay, you know what I'm saying? That person helped me out today. You feel me? Failure is inevitable. It's gonna happen, but use it as a lesson. I failed so much in my life. You're gonna fail at not loving yourself for a couple times, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna go back into that relationship. You're gonna go back into that, that situation that you was in, that situation, that, 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 that relationship that was causing you all this pain and that hurt that, that you know what I'm saying? And you're gonna continue to go back to it. And you're gonna fail, you're gonna fail yourself, and you're gonna be like, dang, it's a lesson learned. And then eventually it's gonna come across like, okay, maybe I should do something different. Maybe I should go ahead and walk away from this. You know what I'm saying? Because every time I start loving myself, I end up going back to this person. I end up going to, back to this guy or this girl, and I continue to feel a, the same way. I thought I was, I thought I was loving myself. I thought it was, I thought it was me. Whole time is not, you know what I'm saying? You allowing somebody to drain you down. So now you learn from that failure. You learn from, you know what I'm saying? Okay, I can't keep going back. I gotta, I gotta, uh, I gotta, I gotta worry about myself for a little bit. I gotta step back. I gotta stay away from certain people like this. Let me let me let me step. You know what I'm saying? Step back from a couple people like this, because these are the people that's making me feel so drained and so you know what I'm saying, not energetic right now. You go to certain jobs, you have certain you have certain you know what I'm saying places that you work at, and you do it you do a task. You know what I'm saying? You 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 do a task. And you wondering why it's taking you so long to do it? And you after so many days, you like man, let me. I'm failing. I'm not doing my job like I'm supposed to. Let me go ahead and change up my ways you feel me let me go ahead and change up the what i'm what how i'm thinking of how am i approaching this this situation and change it up real quick and you do and that failure that you had because you was constantly failing every single day now you use that as as a lesson to grow to win to get to the next level you feel me there's always levels to it guys there's always levels you feel me? Just because you fail one day don't mean that you're not gonna win the next day. Just when you about to give up can be the day that you win. And it's gonna be a lot of people on the way on your journey that's gonna hate on you. And, it, and it's the people that's closest to you sometimes. And it's, it's a lot of people that are afraid to go after what they want because they are afraid of failure. That fear, fear is the number one dream killer. Fear is the number one dream killer. When you hang around certain people that put fear into your dreams, when you hang around people that talk about your dreams and they don't see your mindset, they don't see your, your goals, and your, they don't see what you see, they put fear into you. You let the outside world, you let everybody that's outside get into your head. That fear is a, is a dream killer. It's a, it's a, it's a life killer. It's a, it's a goal, aspiration killer. And you guys got to realize that people going to hate. Your enemies going to hate. Because they can't do it. They can't wrap their head around how you get so much courage. How you get so much, you know what I'm saying? Strength to just go out there and do what you want to do. You don't want to work a nine to five. Yeah, okay, it's okay to work a nine to five and you like doing what you're doing. That's cool. But I want to own my own. I want to, I want to, I want to own my own. I want people to work for me, not me work for somebody else's dream. I want people to work for what I got going on. And I actually treat them right. You feel me? That's what, that's, that's my goal. I don't want to work for somebody else's dream. I want my own. I want to, I want to get after what I got. I want to be the owner of, of my business. Shit, if you want to, if you like doing construction and you working for somebody, start your own business up. 
Be your own boss. You feel me? You ain't gotta sign underneath the label to, to 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 make your music to be to be known. Nah, you ain't gotta do that. Start your own label up. It can start from the bottom. I'm talking about bro. You feel me? If you wanna be a if you wanna be an entrepreneur and start just a business and whatever it is that you would do it, you ain't gotta bro. Come on, man. Start your stuff up from the ground up. Even though you're working your nine to five, you can still do your business. You can still, you know what I'm saying, uh, create your craft on the side. People are so, you know what I'm saying, we so caught up in just having fun and just doing everything, but we're not really ready to make a movement. We're really not trying to take over. We're really not trying to, you know what I'm saying? There's a lot of people that's out here talking about it, but they ain't really doing it. They ain't really trying it. They ain't really putting it towards, you know what I'm saying, putting it for, for first. I mean, I can't even speak right now, y'all. They're not even putting it in motion, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of people that talk about it, but they don't, they don't do it. Hey, you gonna fail. Use it as a lesson. And people, and when people see that you fail, they gonna hate, they gonna laugh at you, they gonna talk so much trash. I told you you couldn't do it. Ha, 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 I told you, bro. I don't, you should just go ahead and give up, bro. I don't even think you should do this no more, bro. You, you only gain, you only, you, 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 you know what I'm saying? Your video's only getting, you know what I'm saying, 30 views. Your, your video's only getting 30 views. Oh man, you only sold two products today, bro. You only washing somebody's car two times a week. You know what I'm saying? You want to start your own detailing business. You, you, you only, you only doing this. You only got a, a few customers, and when you fail, they gonna laugh at you, and you gonna think to yourself, "Dang, is this, is this, is, is this the right thing that I should be doing right now?" Don't give up. Don't give up. And and, and, and it's so many people that you don't even realize that's, that's that's rooting for you. It's people that told you before they passed away. Hey, you are meant for something special. You are meant for, hey, you are meant for something. Do it for them. I'm telling you, bro. You'd be surprised. You feel me? You'd be surprised at who root for. You'd be surprised at the, at the energy that's still around you that you could no longer see. You feel me? From the from the three dimensional, from the from the light code. You know, you can't see them, but they can still see you, and you can you can feel them though. And they they rooting for you. They see that you starting to make progress and they and they rooting for you. They they hey, they help you along the way. They tell you to stay away from certain people that's 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 trying to bring you down. And they making moves for you too. Take care of your mind, your body, and your soul, man. Don't let the fear of failure stop you from reaching your goals and your dreams. Don't let people stop you from reaching your Don't let the devil use the people closest to you to stop you from reaching your goals and dreams because eventually when you do make it, they're going to ask you how you did it. They're going to ask you what it is that you're doing. Can you put me on? And it's still going to be to the point to where they're still going to try to tear you down. Don't allow it to. Don't allow that to happen, y'all. Like I said, take care of your mind, your body, and your soul. Go outside, get some sun, get some nature. You feel me? If y'all can, plant y'all's foods. If y'all can't, so be it. Just make sure y'all eating right. Meditate. Go to the gym. Work out. Get some sun. Drink y'all's water. You feel me? It's, it's much needed right now. You feel me? I really do appreciate y'all. I love y'all. I have to tell y'all in every single video because y'all are my soul family. Y'all are my family. When I read the comments, y'all just motivate me. Y'all inspire me. Y'all keep me going every single day. I ain't met y'all yet, but one day we will. You feel me? Y'all been smashing that like button, and I really do appreciate that, man. Once again, let's try to get 130 likes on this video. I really do appreciate 10K subscribers, man. We're on the road to 15K. We grind it every single day, and we ain't stopping, you dig? I got the pranks, I got the vlogs, I got what you need. All you need to do is subscribe to me. I'm out of here, man. Peace.